It could be all tomorrow. And y'all are laughing and making a mockery as if he doesn't need our support. Well, why do you care? You're not black. You're not from the black community. Black people should be able to call out other black people. Just like you have white people who call out other white people, you have Jewish people that call out other Jewish people, uh, Hispanic people that call out each other. Black people can call out each other. Okay, Heffa, worry about yourself. You're, what, you upset you can't go to none of those Diddy parties anymore, you freak? You can't go to those Diddy parties anymore, that's why you're upset? You don't need to. Go get a job, Okay. Get a career. Stop worrying about why black men are calling out Diddy. Worry about your own community. This is my problem with you non-melanated people. Y'all always in people's business. Then when you get cooked, you get upset. Don't worry about why we calling out Diddy. As if it doesn't matter. This matters because the jury that's going to see this type of shit is, is looking at the shit. Whether they say they are or not, they are. So it's like, y'all are literally making a mockery of him as if it can't be you tomorrow. And it should be some of you niggas, because some of you dirtball ass niggas are really sexually harassing, really, really sexually assaulting girls, and really having to spike women's drinks and force them and make them do drugs to fuck with you. So are you admitting that Diddy actually did those things? And this is my problem with women like this. So you're you're upset because the only parties you were getting into were the Diddy parties. So you can't go to the Diddy parties anymore. So now you're online venting towards black people. Heffa, you know, you need a life, a career. OK, go finish high school or something. Get offline trying to be an influencer. You're making these stupid video or this one trying to talk down to black people who have more than you, who are more successful than you, who don't go to Diddy parties, okay? Because they actually have self-respect, unlike you waiting around for a rapper to notice you. These are the type of people we have out here. What's good, Jean Marie Rochester? Shout out to everybody. So make sure y'all like the stream. We tired of y'all heifers. We tired of y'all and y'all gonna get called out, Okay. You made this ridiculous video trying to talk down to black people. I don't know why y'all think that y'all can just point your finger and talk crazy to us and think you're not going to get a response. Because I don't talk down to whatever community you come from. So don't try to point the finger at black people. Black people are cleaning house. That's what we're doing. And we have every right to do that. Not you dumb, brainless, loser heifers who have to, you know, get BBLs and, you know, sleep with these entertainers in order to become somebody. You know, you know, do something with your life instead of worrying about ditty parties. People got hurt at those parties. From what has been said, what has been alleged. And you're more concerned about the fact that you can't go to those parties anymore. What if you got drugged? Heffa, what if you got drugged? I don't think you'd be making this video. If you do, you'd be making videos going off on Diddy. Call him every name in the book, probably accusing him of something so you could, so you could um, sue him. I'm tired of these heifers, man. I really am. You fake influencer want to be heifers. Go get a job, career, education. Stop trying to be an influencer. That the, the, It's over. See, you know, it's so oversaturated. Being an IG model influencer used to mean something because you had the women that were actually attractive getting attention. Now you heifers go get all these surgeries just so you can look attractive a little bit. And you still don't get nowhere. You go to a few parties, get slurred out. You might get pregnant. That's it. You might get a few trips, right? What do you have to show for in the long run? Some of y'all are really having to do that shit. Diddy's not. Like, I just... <laughs> he's fucked with the baddest bitches. Why do you think that he needs to spike your drink to fuck him? Or make you do drugs to fuck him? But you willingly took that, took them drugs. You wanted to vibe and be a, you wanted to be a vibe and get invited to the next rendezvous and party out. But I've already spoken that piece. I'm not going to speak on it again. But you niggas are lame as fuck. 
the ones that are laughing at him, making jokes about him. This is his livelihood. His livelihood is spiking people's. No, no, no. So Diddy's livelihood is is taking what his artists made, taking their money and not paying them, only giving them their royalties when the money was dried up from it. You're talking about that. This man has ruined people's lives. And here you are making this video because you can't go to no more Diddy parties. Is that what your life has become? Diddy parties, going to parties, getting drunk, sleeping with uh, celebrities. These are the type of women in society. Now, this is why we say these women ain't wife material. We mean that. This is why men are going overseas. This is the type of woman in society now. She more concerned about going to parties than she is about getting her life together. She don't care about the fact that women are accusing Diddy of doing things to them. She's overlooking that and blaming black people. We are, you know, it's it, not, not black people. She's attacking black men. This loser is attacking black men. I'm, this, the reason why I'm going off like this is because you have some nerve to make a video attacking black men. Okay, just because you sleep with them or whatever, who cares? I don't care how many black men you've been with. That don't give you the right to try to point your finger at us and tell us that we're wrong for cleaning the house. This to me is proof of why a lot of y'all ain't married. A lot of y'all can't get a man. You can't keep one. A revolving door. Because those men know that you're only good for one thing. And it ain't relationships. And y'all are acting as if this is a joke. I don't it give is a fuck a joke. if he had 10,000 bottles of baby oil. Niggas is ashy. He has guests. Y'all not going to talk about any other things that he may have kept in his home. Dental kits, toothbrushes. Like, I'm over it. Fuck. Just want you to know, you're lame. If you're on the internet making fun of a black man's demise... You're trash. You're a loser. You really are fucking, especially being another black man. Y'all see? Like you. <laughs> she's made it clear who she's upset at. <laughs> Diddy is being called out by everybody. Diddy is not just being called out by black men. Okay? Diddy is being called out by black men, black women. You know, you have white people, non, you know, non-black people. He's getting called out by everybody. But this woman is mad at black men. Do y'all not see how crazy that is? She's more upset at black men. You're a fucking loser. I want you to hear me clearly. So, I want to know. She's upset at black men. This goofy heifer's upset at black men. She upset at black men. You hard face heifer, you. You're upset at black men. You're sitting in your room. You probably rent. You probably got a bunch of roommates, or you're living with your parents. You're making this video, and you're calling other people losers, but you're but you're mad. At black men for calling out Diddy, so black men can't call out Diddy. Y'all see how stupid this woman is? She must be getting paid. She must she might be screwing one of his sons. Must be one of his one of his side pieces. He can't pay her anymore. She ain't on the payroll no more. Now she's mad at black men. You not mad at the feds? You not, you know what I'm saying? She's mad at black men. She's taking her anger out on black men. Go get a life. You're not an attractive woman. Go get another career. You're online, angry at, go worry about your own community. Okay, stop trying to be an influencer going to parties. You look crazy. What is wrong with these heifers? This is why... Men are going overseas. 
to hell with these Americanized women like this, 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 this clueless calling other people losers. No, we looking at a loser here because it takes a loser like this to make a video like this.